one, are you a developer or an intending developer and you want to build a house on the island? There are some basic things you need to know before you start building that house. Apart from getting your soil test done, then getting your building plan approval, you need to know the kind of foundation you need to have for your building because of the type of soil you have on the island, especially areas where you have properties that were sound filled. So today in this video, I'm going to be giving you accurate information that will guide you to having your own foundation that house you want to start building whether you're going to have a raft foundation or you are going to have piling on your property because of what i do i come across a lot of buildings some are beautifully finished some are poorly finished so there are lots of reasons why your building can be poorly finished or why your building can be beautifully finished so when you do your soil test you get the information about the particular soil which informs the type of foundation you are going to have here so your structural engineer does the structural drawing which that means the number of piles you are going to have on your property whether you are building a duplex you are having a two floor building and other, whatever type of building you want to have that will determine the number of piles you are going to have on that property so this property as you can see behind me work is ongoing piles have been done here so when you can zoom the camera here you can see that this is a pie here so what is important here is how do you construct your pie what are the stages what do you need to do or what is the cost of a pie so the total cost you're going to use to do piling on your property what determines it is the type of property you want to put on that particular soil which is already predetermined by the structural engineer so when you have the number of pipes that you're going to have on that property then the construction of the pipe begins so i have the site engineer here who's going to help us break it down I'm going to tell you what you need for you to have your pipe firmly done so remember one of the reasons you have to do your pipe on your property after the soil test if it is recommended so that you have a solid building you don't want to build a house whereby after the whole construction your house starts sinking down you want to have a solid house a solid foundation everything within that house so i'm going to bring in now the site engineer will give us the accurate information that you need that will help you to do your piling when you want to start that your building and now i want to introduce the site engineer engineer clement engineer clement good morning how are you doing today good morning ma'am yeah i'm fine okay you know why we are here we yes, are here okay. to provide our clients the okay. accurate information that we assist them in doing their pie for their own construction so we'll be asking you just some specific questions about this panel i hope you are okay with that I'm okay okay so the first question we need to ask how do you determine the type of pie that you're going to do on a particular property okay fine first of all in any piling site or any anywhere you want to do piling first thing you need to do is a soil test okay. after the soil test the soil test will tell you whether you are going to 10 meter whether you are going to 12 meter whether you are going to 20 meter wherever understand then after that you take, you, you take the soil to to lab lagos state uh, lab test they will run the test on the soil to know the strength of that soil the capacity of that soil what that soil can be able to carry from there that where the, the uh, social engineer will come in to do his own design with the soil test reports based on strength of that soil that is that is where the structural engineer will, will design whether the pie will be 450 diameter whether the pie will be 600 diameter that is where they will, with the strength of the soil that is where they will know the number of pie that can be able to carry the weight that is coming on top of that pie whether you are building five story building you are building one story building whether you are building bungalow if you are building a five story building it cannot be the same number of points that uh, with the person that building one story building your neighbor may do soil test i may not do piling the next plot may do soil test and do piling it's advisable to do soil test whenever you are whenever you want to build wherever in lagos state thank you engineer clement for taking that time from your busy schedule to talk to us but now 
I want to ask this from your experience, as we all can see, he's currently working on a site. So, from your experience at this site, what estimates will you give us to build a single pie? You first of all tell us the type of pie you're doing here, the diameter and the depth, and what it takes to construct one with materials and without materials. Okay. We are currently working um, in Lekki as is. In this site, we are doing a 450 diameter to 12 meter. For the cost of um, a pie with material, based on the drawing we have on, on this site, because the design on this site may differ from the design of another site. Based on the drawing here, with material and labor, to cost 250k. To do a single pie. To do a single of pie. 450 of 450 diameter to 12, 12 meter depth. Then that is with all the whole material, iron, concrete, everything material to achieve a single pie. 450 diameter okay. is 250k. In terms of only maybe the client want to buy material and do the labor is a 70k to achieve 450 diameter to 12, 12 meter depth. It depends on the client. Some clients will want to buy material, some clients will want, will want you to do it with material. Okay. okay, so now you heard what the engineer said. You can do your piling by providing the material while he does the labor. Or he can do both the labor and the material. So according to the drawing of this particular pile, for you to do one pile, labor and material will cost you 250,000 naira. He's providing labor and you're providing material, it will cost you 70,000 naira. So whichever way a pile will cost you either about 70,000 naira or 250,000 naira. So let's be clear about this. All piles are not the same according to what he said. It depends on the location and also depends on the diameter and the depth of a particular pie. So this information he gave us now is about this location on the lucky Azix of a 450 diameter pie and 12 meter depth. So I want to use this opportunity to thank um, Engineer Clement for taking our time to give us this information. So I believe that this information he has given to us will be beneficial to you if you are about building a house here on the island or you are building on a sandfield property. So you need to do your soil test, then do your piling before you put that heavy load on your property to avoid your building sinking after building it. So I want to thank you so much for giving us this time to learn a bit of how to do a piling. We really appreciate you. Thank you so much. You're welcome, ma'am. You have heard from the mouth of the engineer. So we have given you the accurate information. So to do your pie it might not be the exact amount with what is going on here, but this information will guide you as you are preparing to do that your pie. My name remains Priscilla Solomon, CEO of Prime Global Consult. Give you that accurate information that will guide you through taking that decision when you are doing your piling for that project coming across my video for the first time do subscribe as we promise always bring you relevant information that will guide you through taking that decision in your real estate investment and for existing subscribers we just want to say thank you for always being there watching our videos and supporting us all through the way we appreciate you so we'll come your way next time please do share our video so that more people can have access to it and benefit from the information we have provided thank you thank you thank you